Hello everyone, welcome to the YouTube channel Mission Net Physics Exam. And guys, today in this video, I will be sharing the most important information about the must to prepare topics of quantum mechanics, or you can say that the topics which you can't miss. So basically guys, in this video, everything will get clear to you that how you should start your preparation of quantum mechanics and how you should prepare rest of the topics or what are the topics which you should prepare first of all before going for the rest of the topics and how these topics will be helping you i will explain everything in this video so keep on watching the video till the end so that you will not miss any of the important points which i will be covering in this video today and guys if you are new on this channel that is mission and physics exam then subscribe this channel by clicking on the subscribe button below this video also click on the bell icon so that you will get the notifications for the new videos which i will be uploading on this channel along with that even if your friends are preparing for your uh, for the upcoming csir net or the gate or any other similar exams so you can share the video with them too because the video will be helping them in their preparation as well now let's quickly start the discussion but before just directly letting you know about those three important topics or the topics which you can't miss and you should not miss i am gonna tell you something related to basics which is very important for everybody to know if they are starting their quantum mechanics preparation so guys the first thing is get to know about the operators because in quantum mechanics we mainly deal with the operators you will find the operators everywhere even if I will talk about the momentum, it's going to be momentum operator, position, position operator, okay, energy, energy operator. And when these are the operators, when you operate them on some wave function, on some state wave function, you get the eigenvalues too, okay. So there are different, different type of expressions. So the basics, first of all, work on the basic part. And once you will have a clear idea about that, everything will look like so easy to you. Done. But without knowing about the basics, if you will start the preparation of rest of the things, you may find like what's going on and how you can learn or prepare all these things. So to make everything easy, you should take the steps like step by step. If you will learn the things, you will prepare the things will look like there is nothing difficult and there is not actually like there is nothing like difficult thing. OK, but the way we are considering the things can make it difficult or easy for us. Now let's talk about the next point. So the first thing I was letting you know was that you should know about the operators, clear? Now the second thing is there is most common notation which we generally use in quantum mechanics and that's the Dirac notation. So what you need to do, you should even know about this Dirac notation, how we work with it, how it's gonna give you the expression, what you will do, okay? So basically guys, you will be familiar with the uh, bracket word which is b r a c k e t at place of c if you will take this line okay you will get the two vectors here one this one another another one this one okay this is known as the bra vector this is known as the cat vector so basically two vectors are involved here now what you will do if you will have two wave functions present at these places and you have to simplify it so basically what you have to do in that case you will be writing it this way. That's minus infinity to plus infinity phi star psi d tau. Now what I have done, whatever will be there in the bra vector, you will have to take its complex conjugate and the another one, you will write it as it is clear. That's how we consider the Dirac notation and we can solve it, simplify it and that's how we write it. d tau has been written there. Basically, if it will be the 1d case, you can simply consider like let's say it is the function of x both are just the functions of x so you will write dx there same way if it will be 2d or 3d whatever situation or case you will have you can consider the d tau value accordingly done now after knowing about this thing why i have asked you to prepare this point first of all before you are going to complete or cover up the rest of the topics because guys, you will find the Dirac notation at so many places in quantum mechanics. And that's why it becomes very, very, very important to have the clear idea about it. How to simplify, how to solve, how to just use it anywhere in probability in expectation value at so many different places. You will find it. Okay. Now let's come to the next point. And what is that? That's simply going to be 
uh, about the first topic we will be talking about right now so what is that first topic which you all should prepare and you can't skip it and you can't miss it that's important systems of quantum mechanics so if i'm going to talk about the important systems in that part you will include the 1d box 2d box 3d box box or potential well whatever you want to call it you can and symmetric and asymmetric case okay along with that you will have to go for the harmonic oscillator okay and in that case isotropic and isotropic so harmonic oscillator is even very important after this guys if i'm going to talk about the second most important topic which you can't miss and you should not miss what is that that's going to be angular momentum so angular momentum operators their eigen values like l square l operator lz okay and along with that l positive l negative so raising and lowering ones even they are important or you can call them the ladder operators but they are even very important ones so when you will be covering this topic uh, let me just tell you one more thing each and every topic i am going to let you know that these are the topics you should prepare you also need to do the previous year questions based on them once you will be completing them these are the topics which will not be very like which will not be too much time taking or i can say just in very less time you will be able to prepare these topics okay now if i'm going to talk about this point that i'm asking you to check out the previous year questions to solve them so how it will be helping you so basically guys in this way when you will, you will be going through the previous year questions you will find related to these topics by relating them with the different topics too you had the questions so in this way you will be covering rest of the topics too and that's how you will find like these topics preparation is helping you to collect and to gain more knowledge about rest of the topics as well but major portion of our question paper if there are questions from quantum part you will find most of the times or most of the questions will be related to this section okay the section we are talking about the topics we are talking about so it is very 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 important to cover up these topics let's come to the third one the third one is going to be perturbation theory so basically guys related to perturbation theory even like almost every time we get the questions so it is very 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 important one and you should not miss this topic too you should try to cover it up and if you will be covering this topic as well you will find like there are so many questions in the previous years which have been asked from this topic or even all these three topics okay uh, by relating them even with different topics you may have the questions but yeah most of the topics are going to be related to these three and if you have skipped and you didn't prepare any one of these ones you should prepare it if you are just starting your preparation go for all the topics i have talked about and guys these are easy ones there is not even a single topic which is difficult all are quite easy but again as i have told you the way you will be considering them the way you will be preparing them that will decide that will make it easy or difficult for you then if you found it difficult any time earlier now consider it in a different way and to know about the topics even you can check out my previous videos which i have uploaded on this channel and along with that uh, even if you want me to provide you some new video about the topics and you want me to discuss it again so you can surely tell me in the comments i will try to provide you that too thank you so much everyone for watching this video till the end now quickly let me just share some of the important updates with all of you so basically guys as you all will be familiar that uh, with this thing that on unacademy plus uh, there are so many important courses which are going on as well as so many important courses will be starting soon so if you are the one who wants to join the live classes and the important courses by the top educators of these well structured and well planned courses so guys then you can take the unacademy plus subscription and whenever you will be taking the subscription you can use and apply the referral code which is uh, Anjali Arora as it has been mentioned here so by using and by applying this referral code you will get the 10% discount in the total Unacademy plus subscription amount now guys if I'm going to talk about the next important thing here so uh, whenever you will take the subscription okay and whenever you will be uh, like proceeding further to take the subscription so let me just tell you what are the steps you have to follow the first thing is you can download the unacademy learning app the second important thing is that 
you can select your goal which is CSR UGC net if you are preparing for the CSR net exam preparation and third thing is you will select the duration for which uh, like uh, three months six months 12 months 24 months you want to take the subscription next thing is you will get a place to write the referral code there you can write the referral code and by applying it you will get the 10 percent discount in the total unacad b plus subscription amount another important thing here i would like to share with you is there is an uh, a very important offer which is going on on unacad b plus subscription mainly for 12 month subscription if you will be taking the 12 month subscription you will get the two months free this is valid till 30th september so if you will be taking the subscription till 30th september you will be getting this offer okay and guys even by using and by applying the referral code which is anjali arora you will be getting the 10 percent discount in the total unacademy plus subscription amount thank you so much everyone for watching this video till the end thank you